Okay, so the process. Now the key with YouTube is to make it fun and punchy. Uh, also the process should be fun and punchy as well. So basically I'd start off by asking yourselves a few questions. Um, first of all, what's the purpose of the video? So are you giving it to people to give a taste of what a show's like? Are you getting people to know more about the performer? Um, does it showcase what your group does? Are you trying to raise funds? For example, is it a Pledge Me video or is it a showreel for sponsorship? Um, what's the point of difference? What makes you different from another arts organisation that's kind of similar? Um, who's going to watch it and why are they going to watch it? Um, and what's also going to grab their attention? So thinking about things that will, an element of surprise or unexpectedness. Um, and also the other massive key thing and probably something we've learned from ours is keep it really short and simple. Um, YouTube's really cool now because it shows you in, analy in analytics um, where people uh, start watching and where people stop. So you can kind of see this progression of this worm that kind of people cut off and it really becomes clear that they quite often cut off between 30 seconds and a minute. So if you're, for example, doing comedy, you've got to make sure there's something punchy and funny in the very beginning, otherwise you're going to lose them early on.